we are a fully built out city. We don't have the ability to add more bridges and more roads. And so we need to accommodate all of the growth through walking, cycling and transit. We needed to do the work that upgraded the bridge in a way that respected the tremendous heritage of the structure. It was originally conceived as a very utilitarian steel bridge. That wasn't good enough. The bridge actually had to be a civic icon. It had to achieve a number of civic goals. First, it had to act as a gateway, a gateway to Falls Creek by the water, a gateway to downtown coming and going through a constructed series of galleries above the roadway. So in February of 2014, we began with some of the major rehabilitation of the bridge. We replaced the bearings, we replaced the expansion joints, some really important work to ensure the structural stability of the bridge long into the future. It's an infrastructure upgrade project that was handled as a heritage conservation project. That is very unusual on infrastructure projects. Usually the upgrade or requirements overwhelm the potential to save heritage value. And I think this project has been quite unique in saying, no, we have to try really hard. We have to try our best. It was also an opportunity for us to bring back pedestrian scale lighting on the bridge. The historic lighting had been lost over the years. The restoration of the lights at the pedestrian level is actually extremely pleasant at night. The two intersections at either end of the bridge, uh, Pacific and Burrard and Cornwall and Burrard, uh, were very challenging design features for us. Uh, the Pacific and Burrard intersection was our second highest collision location in the city. We have completed fully separated designs so that pedestrian movements, cyclist movements and vehicle movements are all completely separated and controlled. You're farther away from the traffic. It's not as noisy. It doesn't feel as dangerous. And the same for cyclists. They're in a contained area. So it becomes a very safe experience going across the bridge. And I really want to take a moment to thank the team that put it together. They did just an amazing job over a number of years and I really want to give them my heartfelt thanks. It's a wonderful project and it will be a legacy for the city uh, for decades to come.